Today I'm sharing with you my DIY over the sink lighting solution or hack. Um, we had this when we were building and I will let you know the why and why we had to do it like this. So if you have such a problem or you're wondering what this is all about, keep watching. Thank you for coming back to my channel. I'm Juliet Megwe and on this channel, most times I'm sharing with you my life's inspirations, some tidbits about living in Dubai and some home deco tips. And today I'm sharing with you my lighting home deco hack. And as I'm sharing this with you, I hope you've subscribed and press the notification bell so that you don't miss out my video uploads. I'll give you a moment to do that right now. Yeah? Thank you for subscribing. So what was this all about? I'll get right to it. You see this light? We had to make it over the sink. Why? When we were building, we discovered that where we had allocated lighting over the island, if you haven't watched my parents home makeover please watch the playlist above it has everything about, about how we did this home makeover we forgot that this lighting once it was lit because we have yellow light and even though we had white lighting we forgot that we would not be able to have proper lighting over the sink because the lighting was behind us so we needed to have a solution on having a lighting over the sink. Problem was, from the top, the lighting or the access of wiring we would have had was over the ceiling. Problem was, this is a storage house and we could not dig through the wiring because we did factor this in when building and we didn't want to, uh, to uh, weaken the integrity of the structure above us. The other problem was any wiring for ceiling was fully in the ceiling so we could not dig at all so we could not even tap into it from you know from the wall you know the wall that the vertical wall what could we do so we had to find a solution and some of you might have this issue maybe you're renting or maybe like us you did a construction and now you don't know what to do the thing is, we couldn't tap into the ceiling wiring and that's different meters, different width, different type of wiring. Now we had to tap in onto the sockets wiring. The problem with the sockets wiring is that you cannot put, you know, the normal fixtures direct and connect them to the switch. That's fully a different kind of wiring. These are the things I learned when we're doing construction. So if you have any questions for me about anything, constructions, DM me on my Instagram at Juliet Miku Inspires or let me know down here in the description comment section so that I could answer a question for you and probably one day do a video on things not to do or things to do when you're constructing. Uh, back to the lighting. So what we did is we had to tap into the sockets, the normal socket. You know the one that you do the kettle? The thing is, then we had to do the kind where you plug in a lighting. Problem is, there's no place here where you can put like a lamp. There's no place where we could plug in. So, checking here, we pulled in the wiring to have a socket in the cabinet that's hidden. And then, we drilled a hole and connected that wiring into the socket. So the socket is always on. And then we stuck this lighting that needed to fit it with everything else in the home so that it looked like it has always been there. So all we need to do is do a switch here and there. For you, probably you will get one that you will have a switch directly on the lamp. We could find one. For this kind of lighting so we did this kind and you can see i've coiled this cable around what am i doing i'm just finding a solution for my problem i always say 
is always a solution to your problem and if I can do it myself you can do it yourself too so this is how the lighting looks during the day the socket looks and the bulbs look like they were there from the beginning you know so the solution is fine find your style stick with your style and first a solution that is not you know you're not digging out you're not destroying what you already have that works within that setting and this is how it looks during the night You can see the times when we don't have lighting, the sink area is quite dark. But when we have the lighting on, it's adding some lighting and still keeping the place lovely, sticking with the theme, sticking with us. Lighting solution, not being overbearing. So if you have questions, this was my solution, people. If you have other questions, other troubleshooting questions, for me what you can do. Let me know and I can help find a solution for you or tell you what I've already done when I'm trying to find solutions for my problem, my home decor tips. So thank you for watching. I hope you've subscribed and press the notification bell so that you don't miss out on my next video upload. God bless you. Barakatele. See you next time.